My first guest is an Oscar-winning actress who stars in the new animated movie, The Crudes, A New Age, which is in theaters this Wednesday. Here's our pal, Emma Stone. Oh, Emma, it is so... Hello! Oh, you look fantastic. It's so good to see your face. You're Thank you for being on the show. It's great to see your face. Thank oh. you for having me. This is so weird. I'm used to kind of, like, dancing on with you. And... I know, right? We're having an entrance theme. Uh, well, next, next time. Next time you will be in person. Next time. Yeah, I yes. know. I know. Yeah. I have, this I have is the faith. right. This is the right decision for now. Thank you. Yeah, good, good. good. I, I, I want to get into. Uh, there's a ton of stuff I want to talk to you about, but uh, I wanted, I wanted to ask you what you've been up to during quarantine. And I was told our producers to ask you this, because a lot of people are revisiting old hobbies. And then uh, they said that you, you made me something because you got into making bracelets. I got into making bracelets. Yes. I mean, I've been doing the kind of like typical you know, Zoom meetings, sleeping more than usual, <laughs> eating more than usual kind of thing. But then I got into making, uh, you know, like stretchy string and, and bead, beaded bracelets. No, I have it and here. And so I had to send one over to you. No, did, did you sign this? Yeah. <laughs> I love that. And I love okay, that I'm says, glad you like it. Can we see? Can we, I don't even know if I can zoom in, but. Can you see? It, says, it just says bracelet for Jimmy. <laughs> Bracelet for, for Jimmy. It's so yeah. good. I'm Just Jimmy it. felt boring. So that's the bracelet that's for you. Look at this guy. You can always wear your bracelet for Jimmy. Look at that. <laughs> bracelet for Jimmy. So stupid. <laughs> it's so good. It's cutting off my circulation. So I have like a dead hand now. It's so Okay, wild. good. That was the intention. If you need to get your blood drawn or anything at any point, soon, <laughs> you can just use it as a tourniquet. Yeah, I do. I might actually. You never know. <laughs> yeah. Uh, uh, in quarantine, uh, have you have you got hooked on any new shows? What have you been doing? What have you been watching? Tell me. I need. I've things. watched a lot of shows. I hear that the Queen's Gambit is very good, and I have not watched that yet. But me neither. I've I, I tried a little bit. You did. I thought it was going to be about. Well, I thought it was going to be about royals or something. That type of queen. It's about chess. Yeah. Right. Yeah. Oh, somebody doesn't like chess. <laughs> I, I, it's not that I don't like chess. I just don't. Know, it's my go-to thing to watch. It's, like, it's not your. You don't like. I can do. I can watch anything. I'm not, chess isn't on the list, and uh, it's not on any. I'm going to use chess. I, I hear you. Yeah, I, I have. I pay. Uh, you know. Twenty dollars a month, whatever for Netflix. I want to, you know, I got there's things I want to see, but chess. You want some bang for your buck? I, exactly. I hear what, I'm I hear what you're saying. But I, yeah, I, yeah. I'm clearly wrong because everyone loves it, and so I'll get into. I it know eventually. everybody does love it. I'm really, I'm, I'm actually very excited to watch it. But I've been watching a bunch of different stuff. I watched all of my, fa my favorite show, Search Party, which is not everybody knows this show. It's amazing. I watched all of it in one day, accidentally, when it came out in June, and then I was like. This is, I wish I had stretched it out more, but now I just discovered the real housewives of Salt Lake city. That's new. Have you seen it no, yet? No, I have not seen that. Is that? Oh boy. Really? Do you need to watch it. Oh, Salt yeah. Lake city. Salt right. Lake city. See, this it's only, only two episodes are out so far. I don't really watch a lot of reality TV. Actually. I haven't really watched too many real housewives franchises, oh. but Salt Lake City is incredible because you add the Mormon element to, to it. And it's just like, there's the, the typical kind of like judgment of each other and fights. But when you throw God in the mix and you're like, that's not what he would. <laughs> wow. It really takes it to another level. <laughs> another and also level. some of them drink, some of them don't of because course. of Mormonism. Yeah. And then they're skiing all the time. And there's a so lot there's of- ski bunnies. You know, and... It's just, there's ski bunnies. It's really, I really think you're going to be into it. I will the love it. The drama is extreme. There's That's a woman awesome. that they're in a huge fight because she told her that she smelled like a hospital. <laughs> and that is the root of their fight. Uh, That's a good diss, though. Yeah, really, Ooh. really good diss. Wow, it got under her skin. That she really bothered her. been at the her. hospital. That really I got mean, to her. On. That got it to really her. really got to her. Yes, bad. <laughs> I watched a little bit of uh, Unforgiving, first two... Uh, is it Unforgiving? On Unforgiving. HBO, it's Nicole the Kidman. The Clint Eastwood movie? No, yeah, yeah The Unforgiven. <laughs> it's now a sitcom. Just a little bit of Unforgiven. <laughs> of what? Which one is it? Is it Unforgiven? There's no one here to ask. Is it the Nicole Kidman, Hugh Grant show? Un oh, oh. Um, um, Unfollowing? The Undoing. Yes. Is that what it's called? It's The Undoing. The Undoing. Because he, maybe he did something he shouldn't have been doing. And that's not very cool, but let's watch and see what happens. Or did he not do something? Did who's he not who's do doing it? that needs to be undid? 
One Needs to Be Undone. Ah, this one, <laughs> Undone, I would like that. That's a good title. Is it called The Undone? It should be, but it's great. Oh, Dude. is it? Okay, all right, I need to watch that. Dude, I love she's hitting character. homers. She's fantastic. Oh, she's Grant? just like a... No, it's almost... Silly. That was like when you used to watch Downton Abbey and you would just watch, it was Maggie Smith, right? Going like... Yeah. Hitting it right out of the park. Every <laughs> line yeah. just soaring over the... Every, no, this one... Wait, what, wait do you see this? You won't even believe. You'll be like, oh, yeah. Nicole oh, Kidman just... She's already ridiculous. Stole the I'm show. Sure. Yeah, it's totally ridiculous. I'm like, oh, she's coming on soon. I want to talk to her about that because it's almost like... It's, when you see it, you'll be like, oh, my God, that's a, a movie star. What are any of us doing this for? What, why are we doing When she's out there no, doing you know that. Oh, stop. But you are you. I mean, I can go through my list Jimmy, of my favorite. Do you think La I'm La good? Land. <laughs> am, am I a pretty, am I a pretty, am I a pretty lady girl? Do you think it's, I'm joking. <laughs> oh, my God. Smoking. Uh, I, dude, you know what was on I'm the other day? Easy, what? <laughs> Easy A was on the other day. And I was like, oh. that's probably been almost probably 10 years, I think, since I first probably met you. And that movie was Ten fantastic. Years. And Well, I met you before Easy A, didn't I? Was that the first time I ever met you? No, maybe right before. Yeah. But I, yes, it's been 10 years, which is so surreal. And it also is, oh, this was another thing I was talking to your producers about. I was like, oh, when Easy A came out, right around the same time as when I got my tattoo. And then I got into, my whole family has this tattoo and they, um, and I told them what's been happening with it, which is that it's supposed to be the size of a pencil, like pencil thin drawing. And this is what's been happening to Wait, it over it, the past it's, 10 it's years. Growing? This is my marker of time. What, what are they? Are they chicken hands? Uh, Chicken feet? They're, they're blackbird feet. And every one of my family has them. And theirs look like they were, like, they're fading away. They're so thin. And mine has just bled out. And by the time I'm 80, I'm going to have a black bar against my wrist. Yeah. It is so ridiculous how bad this is getting. <laughs> what, so are gonna what are you going to do? What are you going to do? It's like what? the rings on a tree. I now know that it's been 10 years since wow. Easy A. <laughs> you got your Golden Globe nomination for Easy A. Do you remember? What do you remember from that experience going to the Globes? Who'd you go with? That, I went with my mom. That was my first time going to the Golden Globes. It was very, very, very exciting. And so I, I took my mom with me. And I feel like I've already told this story before, but we sat next to Angelina Jolie and Brad Pitt. <gasps> Did I ever tell you this story? Never. Oh, my God. It was so, we were like, of all people, to be sitting next to. <laughs> had a, had that kind of a show. Yep. Whoa. And my mom never drinks. And she had champagne that night, which was, Gosh. you know. No, um, probably not the best idea, but she was having a wonderful time. I love mom. And she started asking Angelina Jolie, like, do you have kids? Do you have kids? Are you like, what are you guys? So you, and I was like, you have got to be out of here. And she completely knew. <laughs> but she was like making small talk. Like, oh my God. Kids. How was that? Uh... How old are they? What are their <laughs> names? She knew everything. Yeah. But they were so nice. They were so nice. But it was, um, she, yeah, she we had was a cool. blast. We had a really good time. That was a very fun night. That's so fun. Uh, I want to mm -hmm. talk to you about um, uh, the Crudes, A New Age, when we come back. Is that cool? Stick around? No. No. No, we, no we, we, real fast. We, we won't no, even know I where we're going. No, I don't want to. I, I no, just no, 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 let's talk. just talk. Oh, okay. Crudes. All right, all right, fine. All I got right, her. More with Emma Stone when we come back, everybody. Come on back. <laughs> Look at that. Come on, doing it, doing it. I'm going to live the definition of on and on and on, uh, I said, and it's on.